Hey guys, my name is Sidiac and welcome back to Benidorm here in Spain where your boy is building a beautiful tourist transportation company where we've got a bunch of sightseeing tours set up and hotel transfers which is making me a ton of cash money moolah. Now things are going really well. Last episode we managed to buy these double deckers, these huge open top double decker buses which have a huge capacity of 81 people. Hopefully we can buy a few more of those in this episode. We are now transporting more passengers than ever, making more money than ever before. Holy moly, are we making some serious cash. Now, this is all based on the tourist industry, and we need to make sure that our tourists are super happy, which is why we're going to do some upgrades. The upgrades today are going to be for the buses. Now, we have a couple of upgrades we can kind of implement. Stuff that will be really, really handy and helpful for the tourists is stuff like audio guides. So we'll get that researched. Bam. We'll also get an air conditioning unit researched as well. So we'll start with these two. We can keep our passengers on the uh, buses nice and cool. And also they will be informed with audio guides from all different languages across the world because people are flocking to Benador. Guys, if you are enjoying this series so far, please make sure you smash that like button down below. Subscribe if you are new, so you get notified when more episodes do come out. Now, the current goals we have are improving our punctuality to uh, 3.8 minutes delay, and also selling uh, 6,900 tickets. Now, what I'm going to do from the get-go is we're going to instantly expand the depot, okay? We're going to build a street, build this up here, la di da how many was that? That was one, two, and then bam, 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 bam. Uh, just kind of preempting where this is all going to kind of get set up and go. And we'll get some more medium bus stops or bus parking spots now in. So we'll do a couple there. One, two, three, and we do a couple there. Maybe one, two, three. So just kind of uh, giving ourselves a bit of room for future growth and expansions. Uh, what we're going to do is we're going to buy more of these little double-decker buses that we unlocked in the last episode and then try and create a few more routes. We want to try and get as much money coming in as we can to fully grow and expand the company. So, bus fleet, we're going to buy some new buses. You know what's weird? The fact that we're making so much cash, I don't feel like I have a need in buying used buses. It's really weird. We'll buy three more. Buy. Uh, we'll load up the template. Bam, bam, bam. Those new buses are now coming in. There they go. Oh, this is going to be good. So we do have to kind of refuel and clean these buses here by the looks of it. Now, we will have our transport order coming in for the hotels. Not transport order, sorry. Our transfer orders. Is that what it's called again? I forgot what it's called. The hotel transfer orders. There we go. And we've got to plan out some routes for the next day. So... Let's sort this out then, to here, to there. Now the problem with doing this is I've realized that I'm buying so, or kind of building so many bus stops that we might not use on the next day. So one, I gotta try and utilize what's already there, which is a lot more difficult than you think. And try not to create new routes is the next issue as well. So plan new route there to here to there and i'm just going to confirm it so it adds it it's a uh, return route back itself they're waiting for confirmations which we'll sort out in just a moment so we got both of them in one bus stop uh you as well and then we're going all the way up to oh here we have to create our own little bus stop damn it uh right there we go confirm bam so confirm you you're only one bus you're okay to be one bus you're okay to be one bus but you most likely need to be two buses with the current capacities that we do have so that will settle for the next day then which is going to make us super duper busy um but we do have more buses so we should be okay now at what point do i unlock the ability to do our shift scheduling oh we can do automatic cleaning of buses Right, we'll come back to that. So I need 175 trophies to do shift scheduling. Right, easier said than done, but we do have some good trophies coming in shortly anyway. Um, I feel like I need to get an additional researcher to kind of speed things up. So in the office, we're going to grab a couple of desks. So standing desk, one there, one there. And we're going to hire some more researchers. Now, we're going to base it on friendliness. 
No, who am I kidding? We'll do skill. Higher, higher. <laughs> Two more coming in, and hopefully they can now research that stuff a lot quicker. We'll upgrade the buses and make them better. But also, we're going to research the automatic cleaning as well. So now we can start to become more efficient in the company, which is really exciting. So let's fast forward then. Let's see how much of that research they can get done. I think they're, they've literally just arrived and now they're going home. Right, the researchers weren't here that long. Now you can change the work schedule. So for example, the mechanics. I can make the mechanics come in like later in the day to fix the buses overnight. So if I said to them, come in at uh, free and then go home at six. That's a long hour, isn't it? Yeah. Number of employees, present during no, no, no hours, we'll do one. That's fine. Researchers, it's fine. Cleaners. Um, um, right. We'll make them come in at roughly the same time as well. Free. And then go home at... Let's say 10. And then there'll only be one person in during the non-court hours. Right, hello. Yes, you can take 24 hours off. Well, I, actually, I need the mechanics, right? To be honest with you, we might need to hire more employees in general. So going it off friendliness. Okay, we'll hire you. Cleaners, obviously, they haven't got the greatest of skills, but we'll hire you. So you've got a few extra now, uh, which would be a pretty handy thing. So we've got to clean the bus over here. So clean you. We're not automatic just yet, boys, but we've got a lot of buses now, don't we? How many buses do we have? We have 18 buses in the company already. That, to me, does seem pretty crazy. Now, we made 50,000 big ones, but we're coming up to the weekend. We're expecting the weekend to be a lot busier. So, fasty forwarding. And let's assign all of these buses. Yes, I will answer the phone in just a moment. I'm busy, okay? I'm busy. Right. Unfortunately, I'm ill. God damn it. Right, the mayor's calling. Um, if, oh, an environmental boost. Nice. Even though we don't have any electric buses, but it doesn't matter. Nice. <laughs> right, research is now taking place. We've got three researchers now all on the go. And that's going to help us out. Buses have been sent out for their daily routes at the moment. And what we'll do is we'll we'll kind of upgrade the buses that I've got, the brand new ones and the ones that currently exist, before I create the new route, so at least then we can send them out with the upgrades all on. So, research-wise, how are they getting on right now? Where are they at? So they're working on research in the air conditioning, and then hopefully it's going to be the audio guide next as well. Now, there is a few other free upgrades we can get done. The automatic cleaning of the buses will be a great addition. We'll get that done as well in the background. So uh, hopefully things are going to be running smooth, he says. He says, boys. He says a lot of things, but does he mean them? I have no idea. I've got no idea. Right, I just want to see this. Uh, we'll also wait for the audio guide to be researched so we can do both upgrades at once. It's going to be pretty expensive to kind of do both upgrades, but that audio... Sorry, not the, yeah, the air conditioner is getting done, then the audio guide. Did I get confused there? I feel like I might have just got confused. Right, air conditioning now done. What are they researching next? The audio guide. Right, so... Let me assign a bus real quick. There we go. So if I was to upgrade a bus to include the air conditioner to all my buses is five grand. And there'll be a lot more after. Uh, decline. Sorry. Decline. Now... We could take a look at... Oh, look how busy it is in the center of Benidorm right now. Because we have all of our... Um, uh, what do you call it? Buses kind of going around this loop here. It's where everyone stands. It's becoming quite a busy area, isn't it? It really is. Right, hotel transfer orders. There we go, coming in. I'm hoping I've got enough bus drivers as well. Because that's going to be my next issue. Right, anywho... Oh, you calling in sick as well? Why are they all wanting brakes for? The mechanic wants a brake? Literally, you've done no work. I haven't had to repair a single bus yet. Uh, right, routes. No route. Now, I could do some public service lines. 
but it would mean that I am going to be selling tickets, which is not a problem. Um, should we do our first public service line? Where's it going to? Over here. I could accept you, and you're wanting to be connected to at least one train station. So there's a train station just over here, and there's a train station just there. Now, I could make it start here and end here and then you're done but in the middle or then go back obviously so it's choosing to go up it's choosing to go a really really wild direction to go back um right so i could add a stop there and then i could add another stop of here so it runs along that route but then after that, I could maybe force it to kind of head back not this way. Because apparently that's the quickest route. Oh, I see why. Because it wants to kind of go down there. Now, if I added a stop here, it would force it to go somewhere else. But I'm going to delete that Jardines one in just a moment. So we get to there. Goes around a roundabout. On the way back. Could I make it stop here? Yes. And then it wants to go up and round because it's got to go through this system, which is really awkward. So I might just put a stop there and delete this one. Ha ha! He's a genius. He's a genius. I'm not a genius, guys. I'm just a regular dude. Right, this is a public service line. So if I confirm this, activate now. Does this mean I'll start selling tickets like for normal passenger based stuff and then I'll start earning? Uh, subsidiaries. People love it when I say it like that. <laughs> you damn fool. Right, sightseeing tour getting set up next. Bam. Right, so where are we at with the researching? We're almost done with the audio guide. Nice. And then hopefully we get these buses all set up with all this new stuff. So we actually did complete a goal, by the way, which was the 6,900 people or tickets or whatever it was. Right, route nine, we're going to select you. Um, amazing. Absolutely amazing. Uh, we have now uh, on to our next goal of 460 tours successfully. So that will get done in time. But also... Oh, hold on. More buses need to be assigned. Uh, we can now install all the upgrades to the buses. So if I go to upgrade all the buses with an audio guide and an air conditioner, it's going to cost me 13,000 big ones. A small price to pay for passenger satisfaction. Okay. So all these upgrades will now take place. I think I've only got one mechanic, don't I? Is it one mechanic I've got? No, I've got two. One of them is on a holiday until 8.30 tonight. So one dude's just chilling like a villain right now. He'll take some time. But we've also got the automatic cleaning of the buses unlocked. So automatically clean the inside of the bus, basically when the cleanliness is below 90%. Right, we're on that, boys, aren't we? We're on that right now. All right, bam, 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 bam. Now, how much cash cashola have we got so far coming in? 30 grand. We got a lot. Oh, I've got the hotel transfer request on the wrong buses. Maybe we should start thinking about selling these buses and start buying more double deckers. That might be the way forward, boys. It might be the way forward. It might be the way forward. Anywho, we're doing pretty good still. We're doing pretty good. No need to stress, mate. No need to stress. Right, have I got enough buses? I think I've got just enough buses. I'm not too sure. I'm not too sure. It's one of those things you don't... I think the shift scheduler is the easiest one to kind of figure out if you've got enough buses, because that's the, the best visual representation. Because <laughs> when you start building more and more routes, you kind of lose the number of buses you require. It starts to become a little bit phasey hazy So, yeah. Right, anyway, oh, automatic cleaning a bus, right? Yeah, see that you can now see the automatic cleaning coming in full effect. We're automated right now, this is great. So, 
of uh, automatic stuff, you unlock the washing of the outside of the buses um, at 240 trophies. Now, I can research the passion information system, but we'll hold out for that for a little while. There's no need to jump straight into that just yet. Automatic clean of buses. This is amazing. We are automated, baby. So, reducing our bus delay is a big issue, isn't it? It is a real big issue. I don't know what I'm going to have to do to kind of fix that. But in terms of our rating right now, hopefully we should start to see some stuff changing. Now, one thing I'm not offering is internet on our buses, but I don't have the wireless routers installed, so there's no point me buying any internet packages just yet. I can... Um, don't run your buses too infrequent. I can increase the frequency of my buses. That might be a thing that I'm going to have to do, but it will require me having and buying more buses. So my routes right now... Forget the transfer orders... We're going to edit this route. Not ed Sorry, not edit the route. Delete you. Sorry, not delete you. Edit you. Uh, edit timetable? Yes. And then reduce the frequency to every 10 minutes. Okay, so I can't be any more frequent than that, okay? You edit timetable every 10 minutes. Okay. It will add more buses to these routes. But by looking at it right now, we need more buses. Every 10 minutes... So just on the sightseeing routes, I've set them up every 10 minutes. Now, you're a... Are you a public service line? I think these are two public service lines, right? I could be wrong. I can't remember. Can I edit the timetable? Yeah, they are public service routes because I can't edit them. Right, very good. So, with that said, I've now increased the frequency in which the buses now drive the route. Which is does mean and will mean it's increased the amount of buses on on the line so i might and may need to buy more buses do i just buy them now to save myself i was going to start thinking about selling these but i'm going to need them now aren't i all right buy new buses i'll buy three more okay we'll buy three more they already come pre-equipped with the two upgrades that we've unlocked. So as they now come in, they've already got the two upgrades on. We, we pay for them from from the uh, from day one, which is pretty cool. So more buses now in the company, which does now complete my silver goal down here of owning 20 buses. We now own 21. So hopefully tomorrow then our punctuality can be, um, be fixed. Right, hotel transfer orders coming in. We've got to plan these routes again. So bam to bam and we only need one we still need two buses we'll confirm that then uh plan a row bam to bam so you always have a good day and then a a bad day when it comes to where does this got to go by the way up here when it comes to um these hotel transfer orders it kind of like comes in waves almost Right, up to here, and to there, and confirm on the way back. Uh, how many buses? One. Yeah. Right, waiting for confirmation. Yeah, they're all confirmed. Right, sweet. We're good for tomorrow on the transfer orders. Very nice. Very nice. And um, I'm not sure if all the buses have now been fully upgraded. He's calling in. Yeah, uh, yeah. you can take 24 hours off. You have been busy for the first time ever in installing all those new upgrades to buses. No, no, we're still installing upgrades. Right. Okay. Okay. So we're going to see on this day then to, or this next day, if we have got enough buses for these lines before we build more lines. Look at how many bus stops I now own all through Better Dawn because of these hotel transfer requests. It's a bit over the top now, isn't it? <laughs> it really is. It really is a bit OTT. But... There you go. You got to do what you've got to do, boys. I bet you I'm spending a fortune on bus stops, right? Over two grand. Okay, it's not that much. You know, it's not where I'm going. I'm panicking that I need to now start getting rid of them. There's no need just yet. There is no need. Right, more upgrades coming in. What are we waiting for now, then? This bus over here to finish its lineup. Wonder how long until these are both done. 
Well, that's heading back to the depot. So we're waiting for this bus here. Has he got to do one more route or something? Looks like it does. Right, round it goes. I wonder if that's going to be the last loop it does and then it heads back. No, by the looks of it, it's going to do another one. I mean, take your time. You've got all the time in the world. It's not like I want to skip to the next day or anything. Full. But it is giving my time for my mechanics to add all these upgrades to the buses, though. So it does give us a little bit of time. No need to stress, Sediac. No need to stress. I'm stressing. Right, outdoor related stuff then. Do we spend... Oh, that's a good point, actually. I just realized we built these photovoltaic systems in the last episode as well, didn't we? To the point where uh, my electric bill so far today is going to be left in 50, 50 euro. So maybe... Oh, we actually sold some from what you can see there. So I reckon if I built on the main streets uh, more of these photovoltaic systems just here, will that be enough to push us to selling electricity for a profit? My electricity bill yesterday was 46 euros. Wild, right? Absolutely wild. Uh, we're still waiting for that bus to come back, by the way. It's we, we, We're actually still waiting for it. What time does that route run till? What route is that? Is it route 7 here? Show timetable. What day is it? Oh, it runs to the early hours of the morning. Okay, I don't like that. I don't like that it does that because it now means I've got to sit and wait a little bit longer. It's only three days a week, though, so it's not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. It gives me time to do a little bit of uh, maintenance. You know what I mean? Right, trees. <laughs> Let's get some tree stuff set up then. So, big, beautiful palm trees. We'll dot a couple of these around right now. So place a few here and there. I'm trying to scatter them so it looks a little bit more natural. But it's easier said than done, that is, isn't it? Um, other palms. And then I want, like, the, the small ones as well, the little... I call them yucca plants. I don't know if that's the correct term for them, but it kind of looks like them. And then, what's the other one? There is another one, isn't there? Yeah, the little hedges. Tropical ferns. There we go, boys. Gonna make it feel like we're in paradise, baby. You know what I mean? All right, drop them down. It's all randomly placed, but... Oh, well, hold on. Was there another bush there that I didn't spot? Um, transfer order. No, it's not the highest paying one. So I'm going to decline. Okay. Yeah, did I miss a, like another bush? Oh, it's it's these ones. It's the big tropical thing. Look at, look at them. They're ridiculous, aren't they? They do seem ridiculous. Oh, I can finally time jump. Right, I, I can, was completely ignoring that then. Right, assigned buses. We'll start here and work our way up. I really wish I had the shift scheduler right now because we have a lot of buses. And I've assigned all the small ones as well, which is even more annoying. But hey-ho, there you go. There you go. Right, fasty forwardy then. Very tropical, this place right now. Very tropical. Bus is heading out. And... I didn't even notice though, but I had to assign a lot more buses than normal because we changed the uh, the schedule. But hopefully, it's definitely going to reduce our delay. So we can complete that goal, because it is a little bit of an annoying goal. There's nothing more I can do. Okay, if I can't do that, there's nothing more I can add to the routes. Apart from maybe changing them. But I don't want to change any of them. 
I like the chaos that's already ensuing. I like chaos. <laughs> oh, we done it! Yes! Finally, we got rid of it. Nice. Okay. So that gives me 162 trophies. We need 175 to complete uh, the shift schedule. So we'll get better food for the employees. Bam, we'll research that. We'll also research the ability to reduce the bus dirt as well. So that's two upgrades that are completely free for us. We'll get them done. All right, the service center's okay. There's no need to stress about that. And we just got to complete 460 tours and also carry 18,000 passengers in a single day. Oh, damn. Okay, we're going to have to start thinking about selling these buses and replacing them with the double deckers. Just so I've got overall more capacity in the company. You know what I mean? So if I sold these two buses, so confirm selling you, confirm selling you. All right, and I start assigning my big boys. If I can have a fleet of double deckers, uh, then my overall capacity on average is a lot higher so we can carry more people. So I'm just going to accept any offer because I'm not really strapped for cash, if you know what I mean. Um, we got a, we got a few a few spare funds in the uh, the old bank balance, boys. I don't, I'm don't i not asking for top dollar. I'm not stressing. So whoever's buying these buses right now just got an amazing deal. I'll buy, right, three more of these bad boys. So sold two, bought three. I've gained one bus. There we go. There we go. Noise. Noise. <laughs> we'll see how we get on with that. I could complete this goal today, you just don't know. It'll be nice to, because then I'll be able to unlock my shift scheduler. That would be pretty good. It would be pretty good. Right, so the passenger information system, although that is probably more destined for basic commuter routes, it's still going to be handy for our tourists anyway. Because at least I know how far away from a stop they are and all that kind of jazz, so I might as well, I might as well pay for this now to be researched and get this all upgraded. All right, assign some more buses. Now, we're not far off from being halfway for this goal. So we could do it today. We could do it today. It's all dependent. I mean, down here is like super busy. Look how many people are down here right now. We need bigger buses. We really do. Right, a sign. A sign. I wonder what the, what the biggest tourist bus is going to be in the game. I've got no idea, but we we should. We, we're gonna, I'll probably research another one next episode and to see what we can unlock in the double decker side. Because is it just double deckers that I'm now missing for sightseeing? Yes. I don't know if you can use normal buses for um, sightseeing stuff. I'll have to test that method out at some point, right? Now, looking at it, we should complete this goal today. Okay, we should complete it. I can't see there being any issues in getting that done. But it's so busy here, isn't it? It really is so busy. I'm still surprised that I've got enough drivers. Alright, we've uh, unlocked the, the information systems, by the way. Let's just assign all the buses. And now I don't have enough buses. But I'm assuming buses are on the way back to the depot, right? Right, guys? Right? <laughs> yeah, there's one on the way back. So it's just timing at this point. But the fact that I have to do that means there's no there's no room for, for growth. Apparently, I can assign a bus. Is there one on the way in? There's no buses there to assign. Is there one on the way in or something? Did I just assign that bus twice? I don't know what I've done there. I ain't got a clue. Haven't got a clue. 
Right, anyway, we complete this goal. And then we'll get the shift scheduling researched. In the meantime, though, let's upgrade all the buses for the information systems. It's going to cost me eight grand for all buses. So that's something you can kind of get done in the background very, very slowly. Now, my service center is okay. No stress with that. Now, has my rating increased since? It's still the same, even though we got the new stuff in. Yeah, you can take some time off. We've completed the goal and got 20, 27 big ones back. Damn. So that now means... Oh, I can research wireless. Okay. Right, first things first, shift schedule them. Um, reduce prices of replacement parts. Yes, please. And I might as well get the wireless installed so we can have internet on the buses. Right, a lot of crazy things going on there. A lot of crazy things. All right, new routes. So... Oh my god! I knew the weekend was going to be busy. It, it literally does flip in this game. The weekends are busier than the weekdays, which is completely different from how you would normally play the game because the weekends are always quiet. So instead of having five busy days and two quiet days, we have two busy days and apparently five quiet days. Look at how much money I've made today on a Saturday. Oh, and we got the uh, subsidiary money coming in. I know it's sub subsidies, guys. Okay, I know it's subsidies. Just leave me alone. Um, right, so reach 19 active weekly ticket holders. Is this to do with all like our normal passengers and not tourist-based stuff? I think it might be. I think it might be, boys. But the upgrades are slowly coming in on our buses. It's a shame, really, because I'm going to probably end up selling all these buses. But they will do for now. They will do for now. There's no need to jump the gun just yet. Full. No need to jump the gun. Right. Shift scheduling complete. Um, what's going on here? You taking some time off? Okay. So on tomorrow then, assign all buses and all drivers. We're done. Haven't got to do nothing. But I would quite like to have the bigger buses on these routes. So... That saves me from everything for tomorrow, but I still have to sort out the transfer orders. Now, what I would like to know is, once I sort the transfer orders out, does that become then something I have to add on to the shift scheduling? You know what I mean? All right, what am I name missing? All right, confirm you, done, 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 confirm. All right, next. Bam. To bam. Done, 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 done. Bam. Bam, bam. And bam. Confirm, confirm, confirm. And then you. Two hotels, apparently. Um, bam. And then where's it going to? All the way up here. Bam. Confirm. 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 And done. Right. They're all done. So does that then get added to my shift scheduler? It doesn't. So I have to manually do that still. Is that is that like what I'm having to do? Still manually do the hotel transfer orders? Fair enough if that's how it is. But, um, you know, kind of annoying if I have to. And how are we doing with the researching then? So the wireless is going to get installed shortly. We're still doing the passenger information systems on the buses. But I feel like my, my uh, upgrades haven't fully come into fruition just yet. Now, when do I get to automatically start washing the outside of the buses at 2.40? Okay, we've got a long way to go for that. A very long way to go for that, yeah. But lots of upgrades. Lots of upgrades. We do need to clean the buses though, don't we? We've got time now because we've got to wait for that bus that finishes that route really late. So no need to stress just yet, boys. All right, beautiful bus is getting cleaned. Beautiful bus is getting cleaned. 
So, if we're not going to complete these tours today, they should get done tomorrow, providing we can get 19 weekly ticket holders. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do that. Um, I'm surprised you got so little, to be honest with you. I really am. So, sorting out all the buses anyway. They're all getting done. I'm still surprised that no bus has broken yet in any way, shape, or form, which is why I haven't purchased any of the replacement parts. I don't want to buy them now to kind of get ahead of myself because I feel like if I buy them now, then the bus will start breaking and then they'll all start breaking. You know what I mean? But I think it's because I'm buying brand new buses that obviously they last a little bit longer before they do break. So we're all good. Oh, I'm just I'm just so used to that hard mode series I did where buses were breaking left, right, and center. So yeah. Funny, right? Um Thank you for a great job. No problem. Uh, I'm happy to say I'm currently having a lot of fun here. Very good. Very good. I currently have really satisfied working here. Amazing. Legend mate, we do essential work. Good, glad you can uh, rely upon yours sincerely. Right, sweet. Uh, we've analyzed. Oh, they've changed the uh, one of the public service lines right now for Route 7. So, current ride. It starts an hour earlier and then ends an hour later. Damn. Sorry. Damn. <laughs> Uh, and they've changed the interval as well to from 60 minutes to 30 minutes. So that's getting busier. Wow. Okay. Okay, boys. Okay, 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 okay. Where's the bus? The bus is just chilling right there right now. So what other upgrades could I add in? We still... Oh, we haven't unlocked the wireless just yet. So we're still waiting for that. But are we still upgrading buses? Is there any buses here right now that don't have the information systems installed? I assume the one driving around right now doesn't have it installed. I'm just going to assume that, that we don't have it installed on that one. But um, yeah, it's, it's it's awkward now, isn't it? That we're having to wait. I mean, it does give me time to sort everything all out, which is great. But when you sort everything out pretty quick and you're really efficient, it, <laughs> now you got to wait even longer. You've got to wait even longer. Annoying. Very annoying. Very, 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 very annoying. Right, come on, please. Hurry up. Hurry up, you fool. We got places to be. We got people to see. I got phone calls covered in. We're going to decline that. I'm only accepting transfer orders if it's good per passenger. That's all I'm doing. Hey, boss. Uh, as you probably already know, it's currently very stressful. I hope it over time it becomes daily. Who are you? A service employee? How is it stressful? All right, take a holiday. Come back to me when you're less stressed. De-stress. Have a pina colada on the beach or something. I don't know. But make sure you travel fools tours. <laughs> Give me money. Right. This is a bit of a waiting game right now. Is this going to complete? Is this the last route it's doing? Yes. Finally. The bus is coming in, and we're going to time jump. Oh, no. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we can time jump. So I I was about to say, I ain't got to schedule any shifts, but then, I, oh, when you get that phone call, it means you, you've won money. I just won 50 grand. <laughs> right, so we've got to assign buses. This is our um, sightseeing tour. Wait, hold on. This is our sightseeing tour. Today. Did I do the wrong day? Oh, does it update like the next day it updates with the transfer orders? I think so. But on that basis, I don't have enough buses. I'm going to buy three more. Backup buses. We got some backup buses. Uh, oh, too few bus drivers. Okay, now we're having the issue. Bus drivers, friendliness. All right, I've hired two more. Is that enough? Yes. Right, so it does, the shift schedule does work. It just doesn't reset until the next day. Right, we got, we've got we got our own traffic jam right now. <laughs> we've got a traffic jam, baby. We've got a traffic jam. Right, this is good. I'm really impressed with this so far. This is going exactly the way I want it to go. So hopefully today then we should complete the weekly ticket holders goal. We should do the 460 tours successfully as well. And with the new upgrades to the bus, we might complete our silver goal, pushing us to a 
star rated and um, just forever growing the company. So it is a Sunday. It should be another busy day, but I made 177,000 big ones yesterday. What is today going to bring? I have got no idea. But guys, I hope you did enjoy this episode. If you did, please smash that like button down below. And until next time, I'll see you all soon. So goodbye.